Yeah, I know. I know it's been a while, okay? I know it's been a long time. I'm kind of stressed out. I'm stressed out. Because I need a change. Oh wow, Victoria needs a change again? That's a surprise. No, this time it's valid. I've had the same kind of hair. The, in, my whole, like, I've had colored hair like this my whole entire adult life. And my whole adult life, I've never had a natural hair color. I've gone through so much in the past, like, three years. And I've never dyed my hair because of it. That's a rite of passage for a female, and I feel like I'm missing out on that. So I'm gonna do it. But I'm really stressed about it. I can't even look you in the eyes, I'm sorry. Let's sit down. Yeah, I've been through a lot. And I've been wanting to do this for a very long time. You guys know I've talked about this for like years now. Like I wanted to do this like two years ago to dye my hair a different color. And I've always been kind of scared because <sighs> there's no going back, you know? Like I can only go darker and having dreadlocks and recoloring your hair a lot is just very, very difficult. So yeah, I've wanted to do that on like a like an aesthetic level. And also on a personal level because I feel like when you change things, it helps you change your, kind of like your mindset, it makes you feel more fresh or more inspired or whatever. You have gone through some things, through some people, relationships, this and that, traveling, whatever, and there's a big change coming up anyways, but it's time to start with what I can right now, and that is changing my hair color. And I don't normally post hair stuff anymore on this channel. I have to say, hey, I'm, I'm back in America right now taking care of some business again, and this time, for good. Hello? Did you kill who I said you kill? Very good. That is all. Taking care of business for good here. Sorry. Hey, no, I... I heard some bad things about you. I don't want to believe that they're true. You know what? I don't need to deal with you anymore. I have my people to deal with you. And it's not going to be pretty. Have a good life. The rest of it. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm in a weird mood today. I've been in a weird mood the past. Ever since I got back from Germany. So I got back from Germany and I completely stopped vlogging. It's been a month. And I do this a lot of times when I come back from traveling. Um, since I've filmed so much while I'm traveling. I completely burn out and I... I just do like creative videos for like TikTok and stuff. But I realized while I was out traveling that I cannot, and I, I've talked about this before, I cannot afford to travel and pay rent. So there's gotta be, I have to do something about, about all of this. And that requires me to not have a place again. I'll go through the details whenever I know them. I don't even know them, but just know that there'll be a lot more traveling and moving around in the future, which is, been the theme of my channel for a very long time. This is not about that. This is about me dyeing my hair. <laughs> and a lot of people ask, what are you gonna change the color? Now, people, you, now. Uh, but yeah, I, I dyed my hair red, by the way. It's not that big of a change. But yeah, so I dyed it a red color. Now I'm going to put black on it. Now, I had some methods in my head of how to do this the best way without completely scarring myself. Black hair is going to wash my face out. It's gonna, it's not like, I have warm skin tones. It's not the most natural thing for me to wear, but I wanted to, you know, I love tech wear, I love dark wear, I love dark things. And I always have, I used to, when I was a teenager, had my hair black, I dyed it black all the time. Um, and then as I became an adult, I started dyeing it colors. But my natural disposition is kind of to have a dark, darker type of vibe just because it's, it's, it, it fits me, I think, better. And having this, the light colors has been fun for a very long time. I thought maybe I should get a wig and see what it looks like first. It didn't look good on me, but I'm gonna show it to you. Cause I tried it on yesterday, I got it yesterday. So this is the wig that I got. Obviously I could not find a dreaded wig and I'm not taking the time to dread this wig. I just wanted to kind of see what a dark color would look like on my head. And this one has bangs. I tried to put a little thing in here just to make it kind of look like a dreadlock. But, so this is, this is probably the color around this color and I just bought this cheap off Amazon. Yeah, with my hair color, it's kind of like my signature look since I've been kind of bigger on social media. And changing that is terrifying because I'm like, what if nobody likes me anymore? It's pretty silly because I would hope that people are, there are people just following me for, my, for the hair color that I have. Like, this is gonna affect me. I don't know if it's gonna affect me 
in a good or a bad way, but it's gonna affect my social media. And I hope that it doesn't affect you guys because I hope, I know that my YouTube is very small, but it's personal. And it's the most personal platform that I have. So please don't leave because I changed my hair color. I'm gonna put this, oh my God, one second. So this is not how it's gonna look because this is not my, like, yeah. It's not gonna be like a, a, a what do you call some bob or whatever, uh, like a Karen haircut or whatever. And also my, my I'm gonna start doing my brows not orange anymore. It'll have to be black brows. But it's just gonna be, it's not gonna look, I hope, so much like a dominatrix businesswoman. I hope that's not how it turns out. You guys are probably be like, please don't do it, please, at this point. In the video, I've already done what I've already done, so it's gonna happen, whatever happens. But um, <laughs> I have to, I have to do this. It, it's it. You know, it's one of those things that you, with me anyways, if I have an idea, I, I just have to do it. And just, even if it doesn't even look as good as my other hair, I have to do it. It's been too long. My sisters actually all have kind of dark hair, but my one sister has like almost black hair. My dad has black hair, so I kind of look like my sister. I'm gonna start with a temporary black hair dye. A uh, temporary hair dye, like an arctic fox or something, will fade out over time. It'll probably fade out to like a dark, like, I don't even know what color it'll fade out to. But it's gonna be dark and I'm not gonna be able to ever, ever get it out of my dreadlocks. So this is kind of a permanent thing for me. Um, but it's less permanent than a chemical hair dye. I have to go to Sally's and get this hair dye. It's gonna look better than this, I promise. It better look better than this. But it doesn't matter because we're on this journey together. This is what's gonna happen. This is what you guys wanted. We, we all need a change here. We all need this. And this is, I'm doing this for us. All right, got the goods. We're doing this for real now. Okay, I'm back. I got the goods. Dick Fox Transylvania. It, it's semi-permanent, so it's not permanent permanent. It's not gonna hurt my hair or anything like that. I'm tired. That trip took a lot out of me. Here, let's have some bulletproof. This isn't sponsored. <laughs> it's a uh, cold brew, brew latte. Cannot talk today. Has eight grams of collagen protein. It tastes like a mixture of soup and coffee. I am procrastinating. I don't know where to start. I don't even know if I want to do this right now. This is my outfit of the day. Um, then I have like boots on, so. It's my outfit of the day. <laughs> this is cool. This is how I should film for YouTube as well. It's just weird to film this way now. Cause it's like, how do I fit in here? <laughs> the other night I was, I stayed up until like three in the morning studying like um, translating binary code for no reason. Like why? What's the point? Okay, so it is later in the day. I filmed some beginnings of maybe some TikToks so I can transition from this to black. So now all I gotta do is dye my hair black. I'm gonna start it here, the first uh, stroke, and then I'm gonna finish it in the bathroom mirror. Um, wish me luck. I feel like I should say some sort of adieu to my colored hair. If you guys want to take a moment of silence or something. I don't know if I just say something profound or all I really want to say is fuck you to the, no, not fuck you. I just want to say goodbye to the people, I guess, and thank you to the people that have hurt me an incredibly large amount and I'm grateful for the lessons and now that was in my past life and now this is my, my new life to those people, to those experiences. Thank you and goodbye. It's a new life. New, no, I'm procrastinating. <laughs> so scared. Oh. Edible? Oh, fuck, I just dropped this in between my video. Well, that I cannot get out. Fuck me. Oh, I can't get it. Wow, this is very blue. No going back. <laughs> no, and I'm gonna go into the bathroom and finish this process. Okay. All right. The deed has been done. I 
I have all black hair now and it's there. And I feel that this is more me. I'll show you guys it whenever I wash it and then blow dry it and then we can see, you know, what what, it, what happened. So, <laughs> such a big change. Just pretend that, that that's clean. I'm so tired. I, <laughs> so I, I don't sleep at night. Like I cannot sleep well ever. This is, it's always been like that, but I'll um, also have affirmations playing while I'm sleeping sometimes and it keeps me awake even more. So I'm like really tired from this lady telling me how great I am. <laughs> I highly recommend it. I mean, you'll wake up completely exhausted, but at least you'll be like, huh, am I God? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Change is scary in life and making things different is scary and doing things different that you've never done before that's what's scary and, and that's what opens up your world and i need my world opened again because i have been doing the same things over and over again even though i you know i go out and i travel and i do this and i do that i do it the same type of way i i do need to do things different and try things different but it's hard because i'm in my own little world and when you're in your own reality you don't realize there are other ways there are other possibilities there are other ways to perceive reality it's it's just a new era and I'm so grateful for everyone who stayed. I have changed so much over the years and I'm sure you have too. And we still stay here together. And that is that is the basis of our relationship. You know, that is the basis of a connection with a human being. We are meant to change. We are not meant to stay static. And to judge someone on their past selves is counterproductive because you're judging yourself at the same time because we are all capable of changing. But you're here with me and I'm here with you. See you in the next video. Stay extraterrestrial. Goodbye.